Sabres without a shot on goal the last seven plus minutes. Here's Mikey Anderson. Drifting in, shooting against the green. Stick saved by Anderson. Lebushkin behind the net for Buffalo. Unable to clear it out. Kept alive again by Kopitar. Dursey for the outside. Hits the crossbar. Cousins on the entry. Skinner out wide. Down the right wing, indirectly to the point. Darlene plays it to Middlestad. Middlestad, wrist shot at the outside of the post. We've also got a pretty good stud goaltending prospect in college that we'll talk more about. But we're underway in the second. Here is Owen Power. Rookie. Former first overall pick by the Sabres. Out of the University of Michigan. Steal by Lazar. Kempe, shorthanded with only power to beat. Kempe cruises in. Fire scores! He can't be stopped! Look at the Kings again. With that pressure, Lazar starts it. Now look at power. The defenseman. He will end up being used as a screen almost here because Kempe's able to buy some time and space here to watch 25. He tries to get a stick on it. Final seconds of the power play. Thompson receives, fires off the post. Off the outside of the post, Tage Thompson. One against two, the Kings win out. Asplund steals it back for Buffalo. Now the Sabres are still putting on some pressure here. Now the big shorty by Kempe, but the Sabres have the... Shot save, rebound save, Copley. Second power play for LA. They did wind up getting credited with a shot on goal. Quinton Byfield with that deflection, as we saw. Touch pass gets the Cali and he scores. Perfectly for the Kings. Starts with a cleanly won draw. That establishes possession and control. The miss by Deneau is followed up by Kalia. But watch this. This is a pretty good play in itself. Even though there's a fan there, the way it's moved around. Now, in practice recently. He thought it was just a bruise, but after a couple days, it didn't get any better. And so they went for further imaging and saw a broken bone there. Here's Fiala turning the corner with Arvidsson into the zone. Fiala driving to the net off the post. Arvidsson to the loose puck. Olofsson serves it ahead. Knocked down by Walker at the defensive line. Rolling puck. Anderson out to play it. Arvidsson nearly connects with Deneau. And the Kings looking for a third. Walker scores! from the Kings nearing the end of the period and they're rewarded with their third goal of the night. Against the flow of play, there's Walk right there. He broke it up, knocked it out of the air. That's one of those turnovers that doesn't get you right away. It takes a while, but then Walker follows it up. Is there traffic? Yes, there is. There's a little bit of traffic there with Trevor Moore. So the Sabres looking for something offensively, turn it over and the Kings counter. Anderson. Softly handles that at the side of his net. Kings are able to flood the zone here on their forecheck. Puck ricochets off the referee. Roy is able to play it. Kempe for Rock. Scores! Matt Roy, top corner. And it's 4 nothing LA. They get the power play. Take advantage of a turnover. This one here is forecheck. This one here is late in the period where the Kings aren't backing off. I mentioned, finish this period out. Finish it out. And they do more than that. Look at the exchange of position. Matt Roy, a defenseman, ends up right in the middle of the slot. Cycled all that. But the Kings have been keeping the puck to the outside for the most part. And then at the end of that period, the Kings really understood that the Sabres were not feeling good about it. Roy. The wall, Kempe stripped by Yoki Haru, tossed it into traffic, punched away by Byfield. Numbers for LA. Byfield connects ahead. Kopitar and Kempe. 2 on 0. Save Anderson. 
Dursey forward to know as the Kings make a change. Whoa, that bounces off the skate of Anderson and in! A gimme! And when it's your night, wow. it's your night. Hits the goaltender in the skate. It didn't go in initially. Watch this, it'll end up right in the skate of Craig Anderson. Kempe sees it, Arvidsson sees it. We'll have to see, there it is, right there, left skate. He kind of knows it's there, he can't really feel it. It'll be interesting to see if it's Kempe or if it's Arvidsson. Maybe this will tell us because both guys took a whack at it. First stick is Kempe coming in. Nope. Middle stat to the middle. Cousins tried to put one right on. Power, loose puck in the high slot. Copley flexes out the right path and makes a second save on Olofsson. And taken out of the zone. Victor Arvidsson and Trevor Moore. Arvidsson for Moore. Stopped by Anderson. And those are the game situations that will be important to Trevor Moore. I don't think you could ask for much more from the Kings. The way they played. Roy cranks up a shot off the blocker of Anderson. Olofsson over the red line with Cousins. Burst of speed. Cousins to the net. Save Copley. Lose puck. They score. Off of Copley and dribbling over the goal line. The Kings do get it to the outside, but that flip pass, passing to space. You can see just goes off the left inside skate of Copley, but with Cousins there, he gets his head up. It was the pass at the blue line. The pass at the blue line that's elevated. It gets him to a position where he can just skate onto the puck. He has all that speed. Darlene picks it up. Darlene again. To the goal line. Dursey got a piece of it. Skinner centers. Tuck denied by Copley. Angled to Cribs. They'll start down the wall. Cribs off the boards. Power. Middle step. Feeding the middle. Olofsson a redirect. Is in the net. Peyton Krebs. And Buffalo. Converts on the power play. That is their first power play goal in five tries of the man advantage tonight. Olofsson has a chance right there to shoot, but he, he senses the fact, and it's happened all night where Copley's been able to see pucks. So instead of trying it through the goaltender, you go around the goaltender with a pass. And the Sabres within three right now, so just under five minutes. Their 30th victory of the season. And a 5-2 win.